Today I'm going to show you how to create this fascinating slideshow with the smoke effect. Drag and drop the clips you want to add to the slideshow. Select all the clips and adjust the duration. Right click and select duration. Set it to 7 seconds. Drag and drop the clip with the smoke to the timeline and place it on the top of the first clip. Set the duration the same as the clip below. Here you see that the scale of the smoke clip is not fitting the frame. Right click on the smoke clip and select crop to fit. Copy and paste this clip on top of all other clips below. Double click the smoke clip, under the video section change the blending mode to lighten. Increase the brightness a little bit in the color section to make sure the white background is clear. Copy and paste effects on all other smoke clips. Now I'm going to put the titles. Go to the section of the title and drag a basic title in the plain text on the left bar. Double click on the title and go to advance to change the text settings. Now change the text color to black. And here I type smoke effect. In this case, I change the font to impact and make it italic. Add another text box. And I change it to fill more a 10. I change the text fill back to white. Put a border to the text. Make the color black. Add a shadow and change the color to black. Set the distance to 5. Blur it a little bit. Do the same thing to the next text. And now I'm going to add animation to the text. Go to animation. And I select fade slide 2. 
Add the same to both texts. Copy and paste the text on top of the next two clips. In the second text, I want to change the position a bit. And the next one as well. Now I'm going to add transitions in between slides. Go to the transition section and select flash. Make sure you drag and drop it only on the first clip, not on both clips. Add transitions on all four clips. Double click on the transition and adjust the duration to one second. and press apply to all. Add a fade in the end. Okay, now I'm adding the flare to the timeline. Double click on the flare clip, change the blend mode to lighten. You can adjust the opacity if you want. Add the sparks to the timeline. Change the blending mode to lighten. Finally, add fade in the end. So that is how we create the slideshow with the smoke effect in film or a tent. Give us a thumbs up if you like it and let us know your thoughts in the comments section. See you next time.